up everybody welcome and welcome back to my channel my name is Omotis Otisa you can comment if I like and I'll be okay with it I am okay with it if this is your first time stopping by hi what's up please don't forget to subscribe like this video comment down below so I can get to know you more and yeah don't forget to watch this video to the end as well and if you already subscribed what's up what's good hope you're doing great so in this video I am at the farm so basically it's just going to be a day at the farm literally just putting fertilizer in the crops and the maize and everything so hope you guys like this video and yeah hi everyone thank you so much for clicking so this was my first time going to this farm ever since i came back and that's me not being so enthusiastic about things but i eventually got the hang of it i mean what was there not to love it was such a beautiful day sunny and such a breath of fresh air i really enjoyed making this video so i hope you enjoy watching it and please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't all right Basically, this is what I have to do. I have to do this. Wish me luck because I'm dying. What is she want to made of? Um, so this is maize, mungkoya roots, sugar, water. Mungkoya roots, what's mungkoya in English? This is a traditional drink from the Tonga, is it? From the Tonga people. Mungkoya, Chibwantu. I don't know what mungkoya is in English. If you do know, please drop it down in the comment section below. We have to put fertilizer here, everywhere. So far so good, I guess we are getting somewhere. Ah, we have to also go all the way that side. Everything to do because it's a lot of work for nine people, so yeah, it's just a lot of work, guys. Five hours later, I have a broken nail and 
and now that's out definitely you should not be coming to the farm with your nails sis anyway so yeah exhausted i haven't been here ever since i came back to zambia so just wanted to show my dad that i'm still a farm girl and i'm not lazy like that okay i'm lying honestly he forced me to come here so <laughs> yeah but it's not so bad i really like it here yeah, so i don't think we'll be finishing this today because it's too much hey it's too much i'm exhausted it's too much so we basically done this part that's um putting the fertilizer and whatever and then we're left with like that part till i don't even know how i can show you but probably i'll be going there so you guys can see and then i'm going to show you as well the fertilizer that we put so you guys can see how it looks like don't forget to subscribe like and share this video this is the fertilizer Basically, this side is done. This whole side is done. And then there's this other side to be done as well. <sighs> I hope it rains so I can have an excuse to leave. <laughs> yeah, overall, it's very nice. I love um, spending time here with my family. But I am so exhausted, guys. I'm, I'm really tired. And I think farming is actually a really good thing, especially in Africa, because we mainly don't really buy a lot of things the only thing that we buy maybe is sausage but the rest like veggies crops and everything we make our own milli meal because we have we, we usually do maize and tomatoes cabbages all those things we already have them so we have them like fresh from our, our farm and yeah so farming is important all right is it time to eat <laughs> at this point i might as well just be a brand ambassador so chibantu if you're listening watching hear me out <laughs> my prayer has been answered it started raining well drizzling <laughs> i'm not lazy guys but it's just that it started drizzling so i think it's about time that we go home isn't it <laughs> but hey i mean i still have my chibantu and my water so i guess everything is good so i'm going to do some more farm work so don't forget to subscribe and continue watching this video all right <laughs> Because I don't think I'll be back here. Do you think you're gonna be back? <laughs> I'm not coming back here again. <laughs> Fingers crossed. So we're exploring just to see how it is. Lamb stew, lamb roast. I'm gonna make a lamb roast. A lamb stew. Ha! Yo, hey, when get ready, when for Christmas, ne? Hey, hey! Yeah, <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. So 
I think we're literally almost done but um, overall I really did have an amazing time because um, I was making jokes with my family and everything but I couldn't get to film that because obviously everybody else was busy and I forgot my stand at home Ugh, anyway so I couldn't really film those moments and I've always um, I've always grown up being a farm type of person because my dad is a farm person not necessarily saying i have grown up on a farm but like i think most of our food we have never really have to buy it because if say maize would have to make a milli meal because we have like a, a maize plantation and then if say tomatoes we always have tomatoes somewhere cabbages vegetables everything so i never really had to like go to the market to buy only if it's like an impasse and i really really need it but like i've never really had to we've never really had to buy such things from the market like in bulk because obviously we have them at the farm so yeah and if you guys want to see like a detailed video on like when the maize grows how we do it and how we harvest our crops and everything just let me know in the comment section i'll definitely do that so i really hope you enjoyed this video and i really hope you are going to be inspiring someone out there that farm life is a good life trust me <laughs> you need to own a farm you really need to because you don't really have to buy everything you know what i'm saying you can always diy certain things and if you have any other videos any other suggestions please do so in the comment section don't forget to subscribe like this video and i hope you really did enjoy this video so if you did please let me know in the comment section all right see you guys in the next video Mwah.